Okay. Hey guys, let me go ahead and turn on the music so I don't get no copyright traces, because you know, your boy can't afford it. So um, basically, damn, look at me shifting in baloney like that. Hold up, hold up. Okay, all right, yep, manuals, not the most practical thing to vlog in. Hold up, hold up. All right, all right, trying to get that best fueled economy, you know what I'm saying? So basically today, guys, I'm actually heading over to Apple. You see that little Mac right there? My, uh, my $3,000 Mac decided to take a poop on me and uh, the keyboard just died. Like literally, a, like a couple keys don't even work out of nowhere. I didn't drop any water. It was just, I was editing and then bam, just completely dies out on me. Some of them, they double click. So, so the, the, the double clicking issue has been an issue for a little bit. So I contacted Apple and they said I have a warranty apparently. Um, it's like a recall or kind of like a recall for like cars, but it's for computers. Basically, it's a free fix. That's great and all, but you know, I, I upload videos every two days. So that's why you guys are probably seeing this video is gonna be slightly delayed, um, is because I'm gonna be trying to edit on my uh, my uh, my brother's computer. Which is not as good. Hey, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, so that's how the morning's starting, and then after that, we'll figure out what we're gonna be doing. I'm not really too sure what we're gonna be doing today, but uh, don't worry, we'll find something. Right, guys, I'm running a little bit behind. I gotta go ahead and run inside. Guys, so we just got done with the Apple. We're gonna go ahead and head over. Will it focus? Will it focus? I don't think it's gonna focus. Anyway, let me, let me try to do that for y'all. Did it? I think so. Pause. Yep, this is Nor from the future. Um, I would just like to let you guys know that I'm about to, let me see what I was actually about to say, go to the post office. And then once I got done there, I went to the gas station. Look at these lovely transitions. And then I tried making a video at Copart, trying to show you guys maybe a possible next build. All right guys, so we are here at Copart, and I just gotta find a few cars that we should look at. I know there's an X3 that I really wanna look at, mainly because the damage is pretty bad that most people would not wanna deal with it, uh, but it's not crazy. Uh, so I just went in there, they told me I was at the wrong location. Luck us some. All right, let's just head to the next location. All right guys, we are here. Hopefully we can still have time to check out the car. But as you guys can see, I had no luck. So then, so I came down to the idea to start GoProing. We're ready to go, we're ready to go. I think we're good, I think we are good. So I don't know if you guys are seeing this camera right now because I'm in the first person, back and forth, back and forth action. I don't know what's going on here. Right now, I'm gonna go and roll up the windows. I think I, right here is good enough. I have the sunroof open, so I hope you guys can hear the downshifts and stuff. Yo. All right guys, so I'm back at my house. Why? Because my stupid camera died. This GoPro died on me and uh, I'm not really expecting it's gonna last much longer to be honest. So let's hope we can get some decent footage out of this thing. Something that's so crazy to me about this car is that just a muffler delete changes the whole feel of the car. Let me go ahead and just uh, let you guys hear this real quick. Quick little burnout maybe? Let's do it. Again, a huge special shout out to Ozzo Wheels. Um, this steering wheel just changes the whole feel of the car. They are not paying me to say this, I'm just being straight up. Like, this is probably one of my favorite wheels I've ever had on this car. The OEM M3 wheels, the reason I love them so much because they're thick. This is thicker 2.0. And then a little finishing touch there. M button looks so nice. Anyways, also if you guys see, if I let go of the steering wheel, 
I need to do a realignment. The wheel has been taken off a lot of times. I don't know if that affects any. I know when I did my rod bearings, uh, they did mess with my suspension a little bit. So ever since that, I did notice that my steering wheel is slightly tilted. So I do need to get realigned. FYI, if you guys ever go to Big O Tires, stop going there. They don't actually do services. You pay them, they pretend to do the service, and they don't do anything. Oh shit, there's a cop right here. Only a cop. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my lo my heart. If I would have done anything what I just did earlier, I mean a second later, it would have been over. Oh my hands. <laughs> oh dear heavens. I don't even know if I want to floor down this road right now just because I don't know if there's gonna be a cop coming this direction. I don't think it's time to do a U-turn though. But is that mature of me? No. So we're not doing that yet. But uh, let me go ahead and roll down the windows for you guys. See if you guys can hear the downshifts at least. A muffler really changes the entire car. This thing stock sounds way too quiet. They're taking pictures. Damn! I see them. I want to get some pictures. I did it kind of early before the light, just in case, you know, there's a slippery little dude right here. I'd be like, look at me, Habibi. I'm following the law. That is just way too fun, y'all. crazy um you know reach out to finding nick if you guys know finding nick uh <laughs> his m3 is what you call stupid loud so if you guys ever want to hear a crazy m3 sound go check out finding nick's channel he does all these pov videos That's actually how i got the idea for this one um so yeah shout out to him i really hope this gopro footage comes out pretty good yeah thank goodness as soon as i said that my camera cut off <laughs> at least it caught two burnouts for you guys oh my god i love this car um, so yeah, I'll talk to y'all when as soon as I get home. I'm about to hit the gym right now. Trying to do, you know, trying to keep this fitness thing going. I don't know if you guys know, it's on my 21st day. 21st day, I'm 21 years old. Look, what a coincidence. As soon as I hit this 30 day achievement, I'm gonna be super stoked. Probably go to in and out take you guys with me and get like seven double doubles because honestly, I think I deserve it. I mean, guys, if you guys just stay dedicated to something for 30 days, I think you guys deserve whatever you want. Don't worry about my hair. So, uh, the, the GoPro really made me look like I have an afro. I don't, I just, oh my god, I'm gonna look so stupid. So yeah, guys, I had a bit of fun, I'm able to do some burnouts. I love actually when I actually do a burnout, I'll do a little skirt skirt, I catch it on film for you guys, because then I feel like if I get pulled over, I won't. Hopefully not. Pray for me, I don't. But if I do, I'll get a ticket, and that ticket will be the title of my video, and that video should pay for the ticket and more. So, in a YouTuber's perspective, it ain't that bad, as long as the video does good. <laughs> but anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Driving this every single day is a blessing, and I thank you all so much for that. As of now, I'm waiting on my brother's car to get back from the shop. He is giving me, you know, I don't know why it's taking a lot longer. I think because a lot of you guys are starting to go to him. So I'm gonna stop recommending the shop because I gotta get my work done, guys. I'm trying to bring you guys content. I gotta get my work done first. And then y'all can go in there. He's saying a lot of your subscribers are coming over to the shop because his prices are really good. So my bills are getting pushed back two, three weeks. And you know, as a content creator, I found him so you can personally work on my cars. So I'll have time to keep pushing out content. 
but that's perfectly fine. I'm happy that you guys found somebody as well. I know everybody's always looking for a good deal, so I'm happy for you guys. But anyways, back to business. My brothers, once his car comes back, we're gonna be working on changing the whole car. We're gonna pretty much sand the whole car, probably try to get some kind of body kit if we can find a good deal, and then wrap the whole thing. So you guys let us know what wrap you guys wanna see. So it'll be completely up to you guys. This is Project Daily, so if you guys want us to drive in a pink car, we will. So make sure to let us know down below if you guys mean pink. I'm gonna be kind of upset. But yeah, in all honesty, like let me know guys what you guys think is the best color uh, for the Project 9, E90. I mean, you guys look, at, look it up online, try to find a nice color that you have seen on the E90, and just let me know we can work with it. So without further ado guys, I love y'all so much. Remember to stay humble, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Yeah, yeah, let's go. I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse, man, it hurts. I'm on this earth with my words, and I put them all together in cert, cause I wanna have words.